The Incident Briefing app can be used by emergency management staff to provide map-based briefings and reports during an incident. This application can be used on its own or in combination with the Situational Awareness Suite and is a configuration of the ArcGIS Story Map Journal that uses your common operational data to enable you to communicate with internal and external stakeholders regarding the status of an event. The Incident Briefing guides us through an agenda to ensure we cover all the aspects that need to be discussed during operational briefings. As we click through the briefing, we're leveraging the common data used to support the emergency operations in a set of information products that can be used to reach a common understanding of what the current situation is. All of the maps in the Incident Briefing are live, and we can interact with them. On the Emergency Facilities page, a legend helps us understand what information is presented. We can zoom into a specific area and even show pop-ups to get more detailed information about what's happening on the ground. Each page in the incident briefing presents a different perspective on the event to help teams within the Emergency Operations Center understand the whole context of the situation during and between briefings. We can add graphics into the panel to support communicating details about the current status. In the logistics page, we can see a chart graphic of the current capacities for commodities at the points of distribution. And in the emergency shelters page, we have included a chart to get a visual indication for the current open shelter capacity. The incident briefing application is a living document that presents information about the current situation to support briefings and ad hoc communication, enabling response personnel to ask questions and get more details about the status of an event and response activities. To learn more about incident briefing and configure it for your organization, please visit the Solutions site. Thanks for watching.